we are playing wukong black myth and this game has a potential to become the game of the year 2024 sun wukong is a character from chinese mythology i guess and chinese mythology in the sense i mean i haven't known much about chinese mythology but then uh yes i heard that this game is from chinese mythology as you can see uh relive the tale of journey to the west rewriting a mythical legend and his name is sun wukong so it's the synopsis black myth wukong is an action rpg rpg rooted in chinese mythology as i said the story is based on the journey of the west one of the four great classic novels of chinese literature we shall set a distinct one to venture into challenges and marvels ahead to uncover the absurd truth beneath the okay all right so we got none i mean uh, i i have no idea what the game is going to be but i know this is going to be awesome and the graphics are so good because the game was made in unreal engine 5 and from the trailers and the you know and the demo videos the game looks 10 out of 10 and has every potential to become the game of the year 2024 and and yes i can't wait because and and yeah this has become most streamed game i guess in on the day one itself like this video was supposed to be released yesterday but i didn't find enough time to enough time to record it on yesterday so yeah here we are a day late but yeah we'll be finishing soon i'll try to upload as many videos as possible related to this game and you have observed that i have i mean i have removed the camera from the video that's because I want to edit the recorded content to make a tribute video or uh, edited videos, right? So, with the face, uh, like it's hard to find content again. So, I decided to remove the face anyway. And then, you know, when I whenever I was streaming, I'll, I'll come up with the camera. And whenever I was only recording a gameplay, we'll go with like this. Now, let's start. And I also stopped Fallout 4. That's because the game was uh, too difficult for me right now. Uh, because I haven't figured out the game mechanics like crafting, upgrading weapons. Which is a crucial in order to process in the game. So, yeah, the thing is I have to figure out myself first and then understand Fallout 4 mechanics. And then re-record videos. I'll continue. I'll continue playing Fallout 4, but then, uh, yeah, Wukong is something that I want to play right now. So let's go with Wukong. And yeah, this game has awesome graphics and awesome combat, combat style. I can't wait to play. What language is this? I don't understand anything. What the hell? I don't know anything. First thing I want to change the language. Oh, this is display, that's for sure. Oh, 
Pokemon. Where can I? Wait, let me pause this for you all. Let me figure out the language and then I'll come back. Okay, I do finally fix the language issue. But then I have to go through some cutscenes. I haven't watched them completely, but then I skipped it. And I tried to change the settings. Like, I, we can't change the language settings directly from the menu. So, this is what we need to do. Now, we'll start a new journey. But that was a weird bug. They need to, like, there has to be an option provided at the start itself. Like the language option. I don't know why, but yeah, you have to go through all this in order to change the language. Okay, this is the starting. And this guy, I believe his name is Sun Wukong. And the iconic weapon drawing. Well, this character is kind of a, uh, yeah, it's definitely a god-like character. Man, this is so awesome, right at the start. Send you and those knuckleheads to threaten me. To obey and serve once more. <laughs> I understand that too. But what I don't understand is... You bastards killing my kind! Oh god. Man, the graphics are so good. I mean, not in sense of really good, but I mean, those are well polished as well. The graphics are very well polished. Just any monkey. He's a monkey of merit. A monkey was made Buddha once. None other than me can challenge him to a duel. Look, monkey. I don't make a habit of fighting someone I've bested before. Here's my offer. If you lose, I'll take you to the Celestial Court. They will stay and level your mountain. But if I lose, I shall certainly take revenge. And they will level your mountain nonetheless. Hmm. 
How tragic would that be, huh? You are one of the court. We don't need to resort to violence. How about you bend the knees, admit the wrongs, and we can put this behind us? Except for that pig. You're the one who talks the tallest tales. Good. I am entertained. Speaking of entertainment, wouldn't it be fun if I pluck your extra eye out for my snack and allow you to keep the other two? Because I'd hate to let you miss how I'll slaughter each mongrel of the court. Those below, those above, and that black mutt of yours! Come at me! All of you! Oh, what are you gonna fight gods? They gave you many chances, yet you spurned each one! Such incredible! <laughs> And the combat is insanely good. The victorious fighting Buddha. Have you any idea how many would give their everything for immortality? Immortality? <laughs> for that word, all realms and beings have ruined themselves. Court welcomed you, foul monkey, yet you remain untamed. None shall save you now. <laughs> Dear brother, your edge needs honing. Good. I was in need of a back scratcher. <laughs>
foul monkey! Taste my axe! Whoa. Brat! You call that a duel? The glare up here is dazzling. Fight me in the woods if you have the guts. <laughs> what? What happened? Man, it feels like he got hit by an invisible wall and and there is something on his forehead which reminded me of Neji's seal. If you watch Naruto, Neji has and a seal. So ends the last tale I got reminded something of that. A hero who treasured his freedom above all else. Buddhahood he attained, yes. But cumbersome, he found the celestial rules, for he yearned to come back and to revel in the simple joys with us. Little did he know, his choice to forgo the life above only fueled their mistrust. Nice. Textures are nice. Lightning is nice. Yeah, this game feels like the next, real next gen. <sighs> this stone has stood for countless days on the mountain. Since my youth, they said that his remains lie within it. <clears throat> Unbegotten, undying. Such is the nature of a stone monkey. Though his body was broken, his spirit endures. Into six relics he turned, and separately they escaped, choosing to stay hidden. Okay, so... Those are the six senses of the great sage. Yet no one has ever seen them. Not in centuries. Okay, so are we going to find those six and bring back Sun Wukong? Venture through all the lands, I cannot. Okay. Yet among you, there might be one who is destined. One that shall recover all his scattered relics. And upon the return of the relics to Mount Tuago, he may yet rise again. Yes. So we are trying to bring back Sun Wukong. They believe he was alive in a stone. And we need to gather all the six relics in order to bring him back. Alright, we can do that. Yes. The graphics are insanely good. The combat is insanely good. And yeah, that is all I need. You know, to play this all the time. In coming next two, three weeks. And I heard that uh, it has became... Nowhere better than a home. 
We to death and ever grow. Huh? Here, yeah. you see what bliss my fate well, shows. Well. <laughs> Luck's around the corner. Seems like you just fell from a oh, fruit yes. tree here. Perfect timing. This peach knew I needed a snack. Okay. You sneaky rascal. Dad, fool me. I'll make sure you regret it. Man, the iconic weapon drawing. <laughs> no matter how many times you come around, you're still as mischievous as ever, eh? Yes, insanely good. Okay, just a second. Inventory. I think we have some pre-order bonus. Somewhere lying around here, I guess. Okay, let's go ahead and see. Maybe we can unlock the pre-order bonus uh, in a while. You cheeky monkey! How dare you interrupt my journey! to charge up and build the focus okay heavy attack which i already tried okay the chest feels uh i mean i get god of our vibes by seeing those chest kind of things Oh my god. We got a mini temple. Oh, well, what you waiting for? Pluck your hair and make an offer. Okay, that's an agabati. have long been waiting for your arrival. Oh, his spitting image, I'd say. Up ahead is Guan Yin Temple. Once it was bustling with worshippers, before it was ruined by that fire. Ah, then the temple was rebuilt. Oh, what good is it to rebuild a temple if the goodwill of men has been burnt to ashes? You've forgotten this place, but they haven't forgotten you. Oh. It's a tough one. Good luck to you. Using this talisman shall immediately free the soul from body and head back to. Yeah. What we can use this? Thank <laughs> you. 
Man. Oh god, this is so good. Is this uh how we defense in the game? Oh god, I like this so much. This move is insanely good. Oh my god. Is this open world? Because I can go anywhere. Damn. And I'm not sure, was I supposed to go this way or was I supposed to go the other way? I mean, have I lost it? And there is a lot of ground to cover. Okay, I think uh, I got off track here and then I went all the way that way and then okay okay this is the right track we are going in the right way but uh, there is a lot more to explore instead of going in a straight line Hang on, that's a cutscene. Okay, uh, uh, this is one of those special power moves. We 
We oh, use it as in the first intro it's been fight. A while, but the immobilized spell still yeah, works immobilized like spell. Charm. <laughs> Since you hail from Mount Huaguo, it won't hurt to teach you a handy trick. Now, here we go. Give me your hand. Okay, we got spells. There you go. Should you come across any miscreants, just point your finger at them and release this spell. You'll be able to hold them in place while giving yourself a breather. Sadly, mine is but a humble trick. Its power will wear off within a few short moments. Though it's good enough against boneheads like this one. Anyway, just consider it an ace up your sleeve. No! The young boys these days know no manners! Fear not! Teach them a lesson with your new spell! There you go. There's my guy. Okay. Oh, we got two ways again. Was that health bar? The game has bugs for sure, starting with the maybe the language or. Okay, I need to go upwards. Right, let's. Move faster. Oh, meditation. Man, the iconic weapon drawing from the ear is what made me brought this game on the day one. I mean, I pre-ordered this, but but yeah, that is what. The trailer was insanely good, and now you see the results of it. This game has now most number of uh, gamers playing right now. There it is.
Okay, we got enemies ahead and I think... Can I save this? self advance what is this? Okay, we can... Oh, these are skills over. There are a lot of skills. This is something that I hate in a game. Why do I have to do all this? I mean, I'm too lazy to choose this, but okay. We can do this. And equipment... There has to be other one, I think, that was promised in the order. I need to check what's wrong with it, but... Okay, that's fine. Uh, what do we have? Inventory. Do we have other other other, other outfit? No, we got only one. Okay, that's okay. Alright, I think this is where we're gonna stop this episode and yeah, looks like a bunch of them ahead. So yeah, we're gonna continue this in the next episode guys and if you wanna check out those episodes, make sure you check the description where you will find a link to a playlist that has all the episodes of Black Myth Wukong and, and yeah. I'll, I'll definitely play more. I'll definitely play more whenever I have enough time. I'll record multiple, I mean, as many episodes as I can on one single sitting. And then I'll throw them back at you. So, get, oh, there is a photo mode, which I was actually wondering whether they have a photo mode or not. Yes, there is a photo mode. There is a bottom left. You have to press the touchpad for the photo mode. Yes, so this is insanely good. And... Yeah, see you all in the next episode. Until then, keep watching and bye-bye.